everyone, it's Ember. Today we're going to talk about micro healing. I happen to have a hospital full and as you can see nearly three days of healing time. I don't want to wait. I definitely don't want to use those speed ups. So I'm going to micro heal instead of doing this the hard way. If you're like me, you can find yourself in a situation where you accidentally hit to heal everything and you're like, no, wait. I didn't mean to do all that. That's fine. Go ahead and hit cancel. As you can see, you're going to get all your resources back. So no loss. Go ahead and hit confirm. And ta-da, they all came back. Now, one thing you need to make sure that you're doing when you go to heal is let your team know, which I've already done, that you're going to be micro healing. So they're watching the help button. But also make sure that you're not in war talents and as you can see i am so i'm gonna actually go up here click on talents and reset to econ and i'll speed through here really quickly the most important thing i want to do is utilize battle dressing because that's going to increase the speed that I can actually heal at. So those 98,000 troops that you saw that were going to take two days and 17 hours, once we get through this, I'll show you the difference that it makes. I'll also be able to leverage instant healing. Okay, now if I click on heal, now that I'm in econ, you can see I've lost 17 hours simply by switching to econ and going into battle dressing. Now, to top things off, I'm also going to go ahead and utilize instant healing. You need to activate this before you start the healing when your hospital's full. It's going to instantly heal 10% without using any resources. You can only use this once every 24 hours. So if you're going to do a micro healing session like this, make sure that you've got as many in your hospital as you're going to have so that you get the biggest bang for your buck. And let's switch back again. Now you can see that instead of 98,000 troops, I only have 88,000 troops to heal. I also want to show you how important it is to find your sweet spot. Now, I recommend that if you go into one of your troop buildings like the barracks, you can see that I can train 1,107 at a time. That's typically your sweet spot for micro healing. So. I'll hit quick select to clear those. And I'm gonna go ahead and throw in 1007, done. You can see that's 30 minutes of heal time. So when I click on that, let's zoom in. See how quickly as, as my friends hit the help button. you can see how quickly that timer drops. So again, 11.07. Now if they're not clearing this fast enough for you, you can go ahead and do fewer. You can see if people aren't paying attention, it takes a little bit longer. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead this time and only type in 500. This way I can get through the heels faster. You can see that was much faster. I want to throw out also, if you're able, our governor doesn't happen to be online, but let's scoot in here really quick and click on the honors. You can see this master medic is available. So if the governor were online, I could ask to utilize this as well. This would increase my healing speed by 100%. It also gives you extra hospital capacity, which I'm not worried about right now because I'm not bringing in additional into my hospital. I'm just trying to heal what I already have. 
but that would be quite beneficial if our governor was online and could help out. Okay, we'll just go ahead. You'll see how quickly this goes. Until you actually hit the little fist over the building, you're not gonna get the help, so make sure that you do that right away. Feel free to play with the numbers as you need to. It's very important to keep in mind that when you're in the middle of a capital battle, reservoir raid, or anything where your hospital is getting full, make sure that you heal between hits, if at all possible. If you can micro heal when a lot of people are online, this goes so much faster. And that'll keep your troops from dying. Also important to keep in mind is the higher the troop tier, the longer it takes to heal. So you can see if I do these lower level troops, how quickly that goes. very important you communicate with your team so if you have a group on discord or line or whatever communication app you might be utilizing make sure that you tell your team tag everybody you're going to be online micro healing come hit the help button people are great to help with that i went ahead and posted that in our discord group just before coming in I also happened to catch the team on the back end of trap. So there were a few more people online than normally may have been this time of day. You can see they're chatty though, so they're not paying attention. <laughs> so just throw in help in there every now and then will help remind them you're still trying to get everything healed. See how quickly that goes when they are hitting the help button. I'm getting over four minutes for each help which is nice. And let's see how many people are online. We still have 14 online. That's not very many for this group. Um, so I'll probably go ahead and reduce how many I'm healing each time so that it'll go a lot faster. So we'll cut that in half from 1000 to 500. And you can see if it goes down much faster, then let's go ahead and keep those people engaged by um, my faithful friends allow them to hit it more frequently than are, but I can heal faster than having to sit here and wait. And when you see that that start to go faster, then you can increase the number. Just play with it as you go. Now you've noticed I haven't used a single speed up yet. Yes, I am using some resources. I went ahead and opened the resources that I needed. If you already have enough resources open to do this healing ahead of time, that's helpful. Although, you can do it as you go too. It just speeds up the process. So I keep getting stuck with about a minute 45 seconds left to go. So someone is taking their time. I'm going to go ahead and drop this to 350, which is really low number. But as you can see, it's done right away. Now let's try 400. The point is you want to get these healed and I'm going to be a whole lot more tempted if I am sitting on a minute or two left to use my speed ups and I don't want to do that. I'd rather save them for state warfare or heck maybe even reservoir raid. So if you can help it just go ahead and tweak the number you're doing at a time just to get these through faster. That's very helpful. So as you can see, started with 98,000. I'm already down to 58,000. So 40,000 done 
without a single speed up being used. And we've only been here a few minutes. The more people you have online hitting help, the faster this goes. Because of course I could be healing. Remember my sweet spot was 1,107 based off of how many troops I can train in one building at a time. Um, if you have enough people online, you can knock that out so fast, but we have fewer people online here today, so I'm doing smaller chunks. But just want to show you it's very feasible. I'm going to go ahead and bump this back up to 500 since they seem to be going pretty quickly. Okay, that went really fast, so let's go ahead and try 600. Just adjust it as you go. And go ahead and remind them. They get tied up in their conversation and forget to hit the button, so reminding them is helpful. It's also handy to keep your assembly point and your hospital near each other. On all of my bases, I have them close to each other, even though the base layout is a little bit different on each. I keep them close so that when I'm doing things like micro healing, I can not only do my own, but also help my friends who are also needing help. It's just an easy way to be a bit more efficient. Ta-da! Okay, I'm going to reduce this to 400 again. That went much faster. You can see I'm already down to 48,000. That's amazing. I have healed more than half of these troops without a single speed up. So believe that you can do this. You can see they heal just slightly faster. I'm almost done with these four star though. And so it looks like the team is saying that the only reason they're still up is because they are helping me heal. So definitely appreciate them staying up. Um, a couple of these individuals are actually on the other side of the planet. And so it's almost dinner time for me. I know it's late for them. Definitely appreciate. Isn't that amazing? I'm already down to 34,000 troops. And as you can see, they're asking about it now. asking if I'm in econ. So I'm telling them yes with battle dressing. You don't have to type in the numbers. I can show you. You can just slide it over to. I'm just a little bit OCD though, so I might go ahead and actually pop over to Discord quickly. And I'll pop back into the game. I'm more people on, so I'll go ahead. Now it looks like, oh no, we're actually down to eight. They're just actually hitting help. This is the worst part. When you accidentally overshoot and you're sitting here waiting. <laughs> And they're taking forever to hit the help button. In this case, we just don't have very many people online. I probably picked the absolute worst time to do this, but uh, I actually recorded a video on my other account during Capital this last time, and the file unfortunately was corrupt, and so I had to scrap it all. So I decided I would hold on to the healing I needed to do on this base from Capital, because yes, I do play multiple accounts in multiple states. We're gonna go back to 400 since that seemed to go much faster. Ah, oh, so much better, okay. You notice once they hit help, until I set up another batch, they have nothing to hit. And so 
doing the smaller batches in this scenario is very helpful because they stay engaged. Um, if I wait for you know a few minutes in between each, then they're going to lose interest and hop offline. So definitely works to our benefit. Now we may have lost another person. Now we're back to 10. I'm going to say please. It's also good to give updates periodically so that they know that you're making progress. Just helps them Helps keep it top of mind. Looks like saw a couple more names. So some people have come online and gone back offline. But as you can see, we only have nine people online right now, and I'm still able to knock out this micro healing. So there's really no excuse. It can be done. You can see there would be 11 hours and 58 minutes left if I were to just set this whole thing and let it run its course. So Overnight, I could totally do that. Wake up, everything would be healed. But that's not always the case. You know, if you're in a, in the middle of capital, for instance, or state warfare, and you need your troops, especially in the newer states where you don't have as many troops built up, it's very important that you heal these as quickly as you can for the reasons I mentioned earlier, not losing troops, but also getting back in the game. That can make or break your reservoir raid too. If you run out of troops, you're out of business. But if you can heal them as you go, this is also another reason I've, I've also preached in many videos that if you're not the rally lead, you don't need to be in war. You can stay in econ. You can stay in econ using battle dressing so that you can heal faster, or you can even use hospital capacity so that you can absorb more hits. Cash, Princess DTM, and Hikari, very much appreciate you all. Nos, thank you. So I missed Jay's name in there too. Okay, we are getting closer to being done. Now I only have about a handful of people hitting the help button for me right now. So imagine when you're in the middle of an event and nearly the entire alliance is online. This goes so much quicker. But this just goes to show you, it doesn't take much. A few people helping makes a huge impact. And again, keep in mind, I have not used a single speed up or any bios to do this micro healing. Wonderful, and the very last batch of troops. And that's it. Everything has been healed. 98,000 troops. That's all there is to it. Make sure to thank your friends. Huge shout out to Nos Cash, Ms. J, Hikari, DTM, Misha or Major Bison, and all the others who jumped in to help. Very much appreciate you. Now that you know how to micro heal, make sure that you're using it all the time. And that is about all there is to it. I hope at least some of this has been helpful. If so, please subscribe, like, comment, and let me know what state you're in. If you're interested in seeing any particular content in one of my future videos, of course, let me know. Don't forget to share this with your alliance too. Best of luck.